Well, I'm Kenny Lowry, and today we're going to take a look at a copper fountain by Tony Rugo. Now, this one he's going to call Lilies and Jack in the Pulpits. So um, that's where his inspiration came from, for the flower there. And then, of course, you have the water lilies down here toward the bottom. And one thing I'll point out about uh, these fountains, they can go in garden ponds, too. So they don't have to go um, into a, a pond or, a, or, a, or a, I should say, a patio pond. Uh, they can order the disappearing fountain system. Oh, we're showing them that way. Uh, that could actually go into a garden pond, too, if that's something you have, a koi pond or something like that. Um, we've got it set up in our uh, patio and deck pond, our 40-inch bowl there. Uh, I think this is a good choice for that because the other one that we had set up here splashed a little bit more than, than this one. This one splashes just a little, and you could minimize that splash controlling your pump, uh, turn the volume down. Uh, we have these splash screens you can see over on the accessories page, and if you mount one of them down there, it eliminates uh, virtually all your splash wherever it hits that screen. You set that screen just above the surface of the water. Now the water kind of comes out right here and it goes down one, two, three, four bowls there. So you're uh, where the other fountain that he had made kind of come out and kind of went down the leaves and kind of went different places. This one is made to pour from one bowl to the next. So it's a little bit different sound than the other one. This one has that pouring water sound whereas the other one had more of a uh, a rain on a tin roof sound. So this is a little different uh, with sound to it. Each one is going to be unique. Uh, no two will ever be exactly like. This is entirely copper, uh, so you can bend this around, flex. It is flexible, uh, and it's just a beautiful creation. I mean, I'll show you up close on the camera here. One thing I noticed, I turned a little light on here, um, and this bowl got it illuminated here. And what it did, it reflected off the, the light, reflected off of that down in this. So that's really neat. I know these copper fountains are just fantastic at night because you get that reflection going on in the copper. He has patinaed it, and I'll show you. There is really no front or back, although this has a little bit more of a back than the other one, but there are leaves and things going on back here in the back, too. Um, I would say that that would be more the front, but you can kind of determine that on your end. Right now, I'll grab the camera and take a close-up look. You know, this will be offered on our patio deck, this spring fountain system. It'll be offered on the in-ground system, and then, of course, this patio bowl as well. And if you see something else on the website, some of our large pools, it could go in that too. We might not show it that way, but that's something you can request and we can get you a price on. This is going to show a lot better outside than it does inside, uh, all the fountains do, but uh, right now we have it set up. It's wintertime here, so we're setting up inside here so we can show you. And I'll try to get up close here. We have it set up temporarily so you might see the, the hose come in there and things like that that we don't. Uh, we haven't hidden because we're just setting up temporary. You see those leaves there and the patina, the colors on them, the copper color, the, the kind of a green patina. I see some rusty red, things like colors like that on there. Uh, you can see that leaf has a little bit of a red tint to it. Green on the water lilies. He does all that with heat. Uh, so it's not some, it's not paint, it's not going to come off. And here's kind of the back of it. I think you can get a sense of the sound there too, you can pick that up. As always, if you have any questions about any of our products, you can reach us at 540-948-2239 or boulderfountain at gmail.com.